Zhu Xuan traveled across a different continent and obtained the inheritance of the demon god emperor. I thought it was during the Roman era when I was preparing to unify the world, but unexpectedly discovered that this was the continent of Duluo. Conquer the dark demon demon tiger as a mount and summon the demon pillar. Save goddess, plus, abuse Tang Hammer, plus, destroy Tang Sect, plus, shame Yu Xiaogang, plus, abolish Shrek, Zhu Xuan. Zhu Er, if you want this world, my emperor will use the world as his engagement and the divine realm as his gift to marry you. Ning Rong Rong, brother Zhu Xuan, you are biased, Wu 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 Wu, Shui Bing Er. I have always liked that young man in white, Zhu Xuan, rather than the current demon emperor. Tang Shen Wang. Blue Silver Entangled. P.S. This book has a lot of demonic changes, and the protagonist only inherits the cultivation of the demon god emperor, not the demon god emperor himself. Key words of the novel. Du Luo. Demon god comes. No pop-ups when entering the palace at the beginning, Du Luo. Demon God comes, enters the palace at the beginning. Download the complete set of text. Du Luo. Demon God comes, enters the palace at the beginning. Read the latest chapter. Chapter 1. Descending to a different world and inheriting the Demon God Emperor. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 1. Descending to a different world and inheriting the demon god emperor. Long Haoshan. The 72 demon divine pillars have been destroyed. And the demon clan has lost its source of energy. The demon clan is destined to gradually perish. The emperor hopes that the demon clan can reconcile with the human clan. So how about giving the demon clan a glimmer of vitality? Quote. At this moment. Long Haoshan looked up at the demon god Emperor Feng Shu hanging in the air. His grandfather felt very uncomfortable in his heart, and his eyes were full of complexity. But he still spoke up and agreed, Don't worry. I won't kill them all. It would be best if the human race could coexist peacefully with the demon race. But after all, the hatred between the human and demon races has accumulated for thousands of years. And I can only do my best to reconcile the conflict. My people, please forgive my selfishness, Ling Xuan. Don't be afraid, I'm here to find you. Quote, Mo Shen Huang Feng Shu chose to commit suicide to end his own life, and his mission has also been completed. Boom. Boom. A lightning bolt pierced through the night sky. Zizi zizi. Oh my. I'll go. Sitting in front of the computer screen, Zhu Xuan was passionately chasing after Guo Meng when he felt an electric shock on his body, his eyes turning black. And his brain instantly entering a shutdown state. I don't know how long it has been. Lying in bed. Zhu Xuan slowly opened his tightly closed eyes and surveyed the surroundings. He only feels abnormal pain all over his body now, and his whole body cannot move. Where is this? Why can't my body move at all? Quote. After calming down, Zhu Xuan began to glance around with his eyes to confirm where this was. This building, isn't it? It doesn't seem like furniture from modern society. It's more like ancient or Roman times. Do I have to endure this inhuman pain even when watching a Chinese comic? Quote. Is it difficult for me to travel? But the buildings here don't look like blue stars. Zhu Xuan, who is currently brainstorming himself, is feeling very frustrated. At this moment, a light and moving female voice reached Zhu Xuan's ear. Wake up. Don't be so excited. I just saw you lying on the roadside, covered in blood, so I took you to my small hospital for treatment. Don't worry. It's very safe here. Although I don't know what terrible thing happened to you, the most important thing is to have a good health. Let's take some medicine first. 
Upon hearing this, Zhu Xuankai breathed a sigh of relief. He thought the other party wanted to use him as a male technician. After all, I am so handsome and charming. She suppressed her smile and joked to Zhu Xuan, saying, If you don't take the medicine, maybe you won't be able to do that in the future. Quote, After speaking, the woman covered her flushed face with her left hand and pointed her right hand at Zhu Xuan's crotch, jokingly saying, This move was indeed effective, which frightened Zhu Xuan and he quickly took a deep breath. I'll go. Why is it so bitter? And why does this medicine smell like horse urine? Quote, faced with Zhu Xuan's bewildered expression, the woman slowly smiled and said, the medicinal herbs inside do indeed contain some horse urine. This is what the pharmacist said. Quote, when he heard these words, his whole face turned black and he wanted to vomit, but unfortunately it was already in his stomach. Now that his hands were broken and he couldn't hold his throat to induce vomiting, he felt a strong desire to die and said, this is clearly top-level torture. Quote, before leaving, the woman spoke up and said, you take a break for a while. I won't be back this month. There are too many things going on in the college. After you can move your hands and feet, you can leave here. Wait, what's your name? Quote, don't come looking for me. I just saved you by hand, live well. Just as Zhu Xuan was feeling depressed and began to doubt his life. Ding. Congratulations on the host's arrival in the foreign continent, rewarding the inheritance of the demon god emperor. Closing square bracket. Just for a moment, before Zhu Xuan could react, an extremely huge and domineering force suddenly came from the void of the sky and forcefully entered his body. And the injuries on his body healed rapidly at a visible speed to the naked eye. The injury only healed in a moment. Sleeping slot. I actually have a system, and at the beginning, I inherited the inheritance of the demon god emperor. Can't I dominate this continent? Quote. The surprise in Zhu Xuan's heart had not been buffered for a long time, and he was still a bit calm in the joy just now. As soon as he thought about his cultivation, he was so excited that he immediately jumped from the bed onto the slate. A wave of dizziness hit, and countless fragmented memories of the original owner's body swept through his mind. This. This. Quote. Zhu Xuan saw from the fragments of his memory that the original owner actually had a biological sister named Zhu Xi, but the more he saw behind him, his emotions became even more irritable. Damn it. Quote. He saw the avalanche forcibly taking away his sister on Huangdu Street in order to seize her. When he went to ask him, he was told by the gatekeeper that Zhu Xi had died or was tortured and humiliated to death. He also took out the sachet she carried with him. This was the first birthday gift that Zhu Xuan had taken her shopping for. In a fit of anger, he wanted to forcefully break in, but was beaten to death by the soldiers at the door, with all his bones broken. He was thrown like a wild dog and left on the roadside until he died. Coincidentally, his soul crossed into this world and merged with this body. He he. I couldn't have imagined that I had traveled to the continent of Duluo and witnessed the end of an ordinary person's life. This world is truly powerful and powerful. What an avalanche. At this moment, Zhu Xuan's eyes were cold and full of murderous intent. Since I came to this world, I will set the rules. Quote. Without too much pause, with a moment of thought, the space in front of me twisted and shattered, revealing a black hole-like passage. He originally wanted to figure out who the girl who saved him was, but he had to first resolve this matter that made him extremely angry, restore justice to the Lord, and reassure him. Tiandu Imperial City. At this noon, 
Tiandu Huangji was bustling with countless merchants, civilians, and nobles. If we were to say where the busiest place was, perhaps the entire continent would also be the busiest on Huangji and Wuhan city. However, the sky would change soon because the demon god Zhu Xuanzheng rushed here at the speed of light, filled with anger. Inside the main hall of the palace. Father. I think the avalanche needs to be properly disciplined. Otherwise it will cause big trouble sooner or later. Zhu Ching'e was very interested in this matter. Not long ago, he heard that the avalanche raped the girl and killed her, as well as the other party's family of two. This made him very angry, so today he said he will handle this matter. He usually doesn't even watch it when it's particularly snowy, but this time it has already caused a stir, and almost everyone in the city has heard about it. This matter has caused damage to the face of the royal family. I hope father can handle it. Give an explanation to the common people. Bold. Your majesty has his own choice. Has your highness the crown prince been a bit presumptuous? The minister rebuked. Zhu Ching'e also realized his extreme behavior, but this incident did make him uncomfortable. At this moment, Prince Zhu Xing stood up and said, Your Majesty, Beng Er is still young and immature. It's better to expose this matter and prohibit it from being mentioned throughout the city, so as not to lose the face of the royal family. He he he. What a royal face, what a cover to go over, a bunch of trash. Do you still want to have some face? Everyone who heard the commotion looked towards the entrance of the main hall together. Some people were confused, watching the play, worried, and angry, but they just didn't show it. The sound of footsteps seemed like a huge stone pressing against the hearts of everyone at the scene. If one could effortlessly and confidently walk outside the main hall, this person's strength is definitely not simple. The new book sets sail, and everyone has a lot of support. It is important to follow up on the new book in the early stage, please. End of this chapter. Chapter 2. Palace Slaying Avalanche. Revenge. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 2. Palace Slaying Avalanche. Revenge. I saw a young man in white walking into the main hall with cold eyes and handsome features, resembling a banished fairy. He had a wooden peach blossom hairpin fixed to his black hair on top of his head. As Zhu Xuan's true face was revealed, none of the people present knew him. May I ask who you are? This is the Tiandu Palace, and outsiders are not allowed to enter, Zhu Ching'e said seriously. He was completely unaware of any fluctuations in the opponent's soul power. He may not be an ordinary person, but if it weren't for the strong, how could he quietly enter the palace without being noticed? It's too eerie. Quote, Zhu Xuan scanned his surroundings expressionlessly, looking at the person standing beside him. He was gentle and elegant, like a scholar from a previous life but soon he felt something was wrong. Activating internal strength, a dark purple light appeared in his eyes, and the corner of his mouth tilted slightly towards Shwiking River, giving him a somewhat meaningful appearance. It's not easy, little angel, to take down the real Shwiking River so quickly, murmured in his heart. He thought the timeline was still early, but this little angel was really amazing. All his disguise was exposed under these eyes, but Zhu Xuan was not familiar with this power and accidentally drove it too far. Suddenly, Zhu Xuan widened his eyes and quickly recited, Color is emptiness, emptiness is color. Amitabha Buddha, sin is sin. Quote, Zhu Xuan immediately withdrew his gaze and spoke solemnly, I came here only for one person hand over the avalanche, otherwise. He didn't indicate the consequences, 
and I believe these old foxes could also understand the meaning of this sentence. Upon hearing these words, Prince Zhu Xing couldn't sit still and angrily pointed at Zhu Xuan. Impossible. No matter who you are or what your purpose is, I couldn't have handed over Beng Er to you. The Seven Treasures and Glass Sect is here as a guest. It's not a wise decision to offend the Heavenly Tao Empire and the Seven Treasures and Glass Sect. Quote. If repeated, Zhu Xuan didn't want to say it again. His eyes froze, and the surrounding space began to distort. His eyes turned red, and waves of towering pressure swept over him. In an instant, everyone in the room knelt down on the ground, holding onto the ground with both hands. The snow star prince, who had just shouted, now had his hands on the ground, his face flushed, and blood flowed from his mouth. No one expected the mysterious person in front of them to have such terrifying strength, and they even felt that even the title Duluo was only Sir in front of him. Kneeling on the ground, Zhu Chinga was even more shocked. Her soul emperor cultivation did not even have a chance to resist, and she could clearly feel that perhaps the title Duluo of the Martial Soul Hall did not necessarily refer to his opponent. This person's strength was too terrifying, and she had made up her mind not to offend him, even wanting to drag him into the Martial Soul Hall. Unfortunately, her wishful thinking will eventually fall through. Zhu Xing's body trembled with cold sweat, and everyone present felt a chill from behind. It's not right, sir. Please be merciful. I'm sure you don't want to have a falling out with the entire Heavenly Tao Empire either. Zhu Xing originally wanted to use these to suppress Zhu Xuan, but unfortunately, the other party didn't accept this trick at all. My patience is limited. Within a stick of incense, I must see the avalanche himself. Otherwise you will all die together. Quote. Until now, no one dares to question the authenticity of this statement. After all, the high-ranking officials and nobles present are not cherishing their dog's life and the wealth of Wang Guan. Immediately, Zhu Xuanxin smiled with relief and withdrew his pressure. Everyone was instantly relieved, but the Snow Knight Emperor frowned and called on the nearby guards to explain a few words. After the guards stepped down, Snow Knight respectfully asked, Your Excellency, do you need some tea? This is not a fear of death on a snowy night, it is a natural state of survival for humans. Time flies by quickly, and soon a pillar of incense will burn out. A wave of anxious and panicked footsteps came from outside the hall, making a lot of noise. Interestingly, there seems to be more than just one person coming. Anyway, it's okay. No matter how many people come, Zhu Xuan won't care. In his eyes, everything in this world is just ants, big and small ants. When the avalanche arrived at the entrance of the palace, he saw a familiar figure in the main hall, but still did not shout out. He only looked at the background and could not make his guess arbitrarily. Perhaps it was just a coincidence. Just now, the personal guard of the Snowy Knight specifically instructed to inform Ning Fengji and Chengxin to come to the main hall in advance. When the avalanche approached and Zhu Xuan's face was clearly visible, he was really startled. He stumbled and fell to the ground, looking at the young man in front of him in a disheveled state, his face full of disbelief. But he still managed to hold back his trembling lips and said, you, you. Aren't you dead? How could that be? I can't believe an avalanche. I didn't die. Did I disappoint you? Zhu Xuan joked. The face of the avalanche now was even more uncomfortable than eating feces, and he immediately shouted towards the door, someone. Someone. Get this trash down. Quote. The imperial guards outside the palace immediately rushed into the main hall and surrounded Zhu Xuan. 
seeing Zhu Xuan surrounded by the Imperial Palace Guard Corps. The avalanche began to feel proud, transforming from panic to the current arrogant posture. Staring through his nostrils at Zhu Xuan in front, he naturally knew that the other person was not a legendary soul or ghost, but simply did not kill him and narrowly escaped. Why, Zhu Xuan, aren't you very proud? It's a pity that you didn't die last time. You brought it to your door this time, so don't blame me. Oh, is that right? Quote, Zhu Xuanyun looked at the clown in front of him with a light breeze, but he wanted to broaden his horizons. By the way, I forgot to tell you that your sister is really useless. She just tossed around for a while and then died. It's not enough for me to entertain myself. However, that jade body does have a unique flavor. Ha ha. Quote, at that time, her pitiful eyes, moans, and moans really left me lingering. The more she screamed in pain, the more excited I became. Give her hope, and slowly peel off XXX. Quote, Avalanche spoke on his own, not forgetting to raise his voice so that everyone present could hear more clearly how he had humiliated his sister. This vulgar language made Zhu Xuanqing's veins burst and his whole body tremble uncontrollably. The aura of wanting to kill in his eyes made everyone except for Avalanche feel scared. Zhu Xing and Zhu Yi originally wanted to remind Zhu Xuanli of the words and actions of the avalanche, but unfortunately, Zhu Xuanli blocked their throat with the power of a demon god. Got it. You can also go down and become a servant for Xie. Who? Quote. After speaking, countless forces converged between Zhu Xuan's hands, and countless chains appeared in the space, breaking the space and emerging. The hands and feet of the avalanche were all entangled in chains, and the energy above carried magma from hell. However, Zhu Xuan did not want him to die so easily. No matter how much torture he endured, it was not enough to relieve his chi. Immediately, he sealed his heart, blood vessels, and brain with ice, and his skin was burned by the magma on the chain. The entire hall emitted sharp screams, which made people's hair stand on end. Ah tilde ah tilde help. Father, help me. I was wrong. Zhu Xuan, please spare me. Ah tilde I know I was wrong. Quote, no matter how the avalanche screams, the snowy knight cannot move at all, and can only watch as the avalanche is tormented like an immature person. Just hope this mysterious, oh no, it's Mr. Zhu Xuan who can spare his child. The Imperial Guard and the Imperial Guards, seeing the Crown Prince's fate, dared not pick up weapons and aim at Zhu Xuan again, and were even more frightened. Be sure to read it daily. The new book data is really important to the author. End of this chapter. Chapter 3. Severely Injured Dugu Bo. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 3. Severely Injured Dugu Bo. After a long period of time, the avalanche had left the person completely exhausted, and even their breath had become weak. Suddenly, Zhu Xuan turned his head to look at Prince Zhu Xing. Startled, he immediately knelt down on the ground, trembling uncontrollably. He stuttered and said, Zhu, Mr. Zhu, if you have anything to tell me, please let me know. Oh no, I'm here to assist you. Zhu Xuan sneered in his heart, isn't this the towering snow star prince? How could he be like a licking dog? It's really funny. Since this world is so interesting, why not? I give you a chance to live, seize it yourself. Quote, at first, Zhu Xing didn't understand what it meant, but suddenly a dagger appeared in the air in front of him, with the sharp blade pointing towards the avalanche. Is this to make oneself kill my beloved nephew? But after all, the avalanche was something I watched myself grow up and killed him. I may. 
Quote, Zhu Xing couldn't have imagined that this person named Zhu Xuan would suddenly come up with this idea. He was simply a great demon in the world. I'll give you three seconds to consider. If you don't comply, everyone present, including the entire Tiandu Empire, will be buried with Xie. This sentence made everyone present look at Zhu Xing, afraid that if they didn't agree, it would be completely ruined. Snowy knights all want to take a dagger and kill Avalanche. Losing one or losing an empire can still be clearly known, which is more important or less important. In the future, find a chance to revenge Avalanche. 3. Zhu Xuan, who started counting down, did not pay attention to other people like Zhu Xing, but stayed on Zhu Qing'e. More accurately, it should be a fake Zhu Qing'e, but a thousand steps of snow. He wanted to see what the young master of the Martial Soul Hall, who claimed to have the highest talent and divine level martial soul quality in the history of the mainland, would do. But there was no sign of panic on his face, which piqued Zhu Xuan's interest. 2. Just as Zhu Xuan was about to report the final number, Zhu Xing finally became rational and said, I'll kill you. Quote, Upon hearing this, Snowy Knight collapsed on the throne, feeling relieved and dejected, and sighed. A pitch black blade plunged straight into the heart of the avalanche, cutting off his last chance of survival. The hands gripping the dagger trembled violently until they let go of their withered and yellow hands, tilting backwards. Snowstar slowly closed her eyes, unable to believe that she had killed her nephew with her own hands. This will carry a lot of curses, and I'm afraid it will be useless for a while. I'll have to be beaten to death by cabbage and eggs when I go out. The pitch black dagger was embedded in the heart, causing blood to slide off. Didda, didda, didda. Silent. It was not that he didn't want to speak, but that no one dared to speak. Even Kian Renzu was a bit shocked, but the avalanche did pay off. Come out. Zhu Xuan spoke up. Everyone hesitated. There was actually someone outside. Two figures in blue robes appeared. And it was none other than Ning Da Lao and Jian Dao Luo Chen Xin who came. Zhu Xuan actually noticed their hiding early on. And when they died from the avalanche, the three of them did not intervene. They were really an old fox. Should I call you Mr. Zhu or Senior? Ning Fengji said respectfully. He also has his own little grievances in his heart. So young, with such strength, the background must be big. Perhaps it is the hidden superpower of this continent that cannot be easily offended. Fengji, what's wrong with you? Chen Xin replied with a puzzled expression, Ning Fengji. Ning Fengji passed on the message and said, Uncle Jian has extraordinary strength and is so young. There must be someone behind him. Don't easily associate with him, and remember not to act impulsively. Quote dot. Chen Xin was speechless for a moment. When can Feng Ji change this habit? It's like bathing in spring breeze for anyone. Is it difficult for anyone on this continent to dare to compete with my seven treasures glass sect? I struck him with one sword. Master Ning, there's no need to be so polite. Quote, I'm just dealing with some private matters. Can't you intervene? Quote, Zhu Xuan thought that if it weren't for the fact that the Seven Treasures Glass sect also had a girl, they would all clean up together and be too lazy to deal with this old fox. Suddenly, a emerald green venomous snake flew out not far away and shot towards Zhu Xuan's life gate. It died automatically before approaching Zhu Xuan. Dugu Bo. I didn't want to kill you. Would you like to die? I advise you not to challenge my patience. Quote. Zhu Xuan originally wanted to go and see the worldly wisdom of this continent. But one by one, all the good dolls saved grandpa, which made him very unhappy. 
The character of Dugu Bo in the original work is still good, so he considered giving him a way out, especially his precious granddaughter he he. Your Excellency, I don't want to be enemies with you, but after all, Snowstar has shown kindness to me. But now that he looks like this, I can't ignore him. Quote, seeing Dugu Bo have this courage, Zhu Xuan's rating for him increased in his heart. However, this was not a reason to show mercy, so he could only fight until he couldn't stand up. Dugu Bo's several soul rings on the soles of his feet appeared yellow, yellow, purple, purple, black, 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 black. Seventh soul skill. Martial soul true body. Medusa's gaze. Dugu Bo shouted loudly. The eyeball suddenly turned pure white, and two white gamma rays shot towards Zhu Xuan. Zhu Xuan sighed helplessly. How could a big move turn into cataracts? It's really pitiful. Fingers hooked, and a small black sphere burst out, colliding with the two gamma rays. Boom. 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 All the pillars and pillars around the palace have collapsed, and the foundation has collapsed. Chengson immediately used her soul power to envelop the people around her, and the aftermath of the explosion caused a little tomato sauce to spill over her mouth. Ning Fengji was moved by the dust and used his soul power to resist the aftershocks. Even though he could be injured, his face was filled with shock. Based on my own judgment, this strike must at least have the power of the ultimate Duluo. Quote, that is to say, the young person standing opposite him is likely to be called Extreme Duluo, and the Han Jinliang of Extreme Duluo can change the direction of the entire continent. The reason why Haoshan sect became the first sect in the mainland and the first weapon of martial soul in the mainland back then was thanks to Tang Chen, the ancestor. Even if the sect retreats now, it is not something that ordinary sects can provoke. Ning Fengji's eyes revealed a hint of cunning, as he began to plan how to bring in the Seven Treasure Glass sect. Then the Seven Treasure Glass sect could firmly establish itself as the first sect in the mainland, and even the Haoshan sect could not surpass it. Imagination is full, reality is bone-like, which is almost impossible. There are no gods in the entire continent or even the entire divine realm that can make Zhu Xuan effective. Get back to the main topic. The smoke slowly dissipated, and everyone thought that Dugu Bo had won. After all, Dugu Bo had already used all the skills of the most talented Duluo, and he couldn't win, so he could only despair. Snowy Knight also pinned all his hopes on Dugu Bo. If he lost, then today's situation would make the royal family never look up, so he really did. Everyone looked and saw Zhu Xuan standing at the origin without any movement. So the result can be imagined, Dugu Bo was defeated. At this moment, Dugu Bo lay in a sunken pit, his bones indirectly shattered and fractured, and he lay motionless, covered in tomato sauce. Damn it! This person is so young, how could he possibly reach such a high level of strength? Dugu Boneng could intuitively and clearly feel that the other party was not using their full strength, otherwise he would undoubtedly die. Quote, Zhu Xuan sensed that two breaths were rapidly approaching, and both of them had reached the realm of titled Duluo. Upon closer reflection, it was clear that the two worshippers of the Martial Soul Hall, the Cigar Duluo and the Snake Spear Duluo, were protecting their so-called young master, Chanrin Zhu. Quote, Please make sure to read it daily, everyone. End of this chapter. Chapter 4. Two Sacrificed Lives, Seeking Love from a Thousand Renzu. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 4. Two sacrificed lives, seeking love from a thousand renzu. These people are coming endlessly, aren't they? 
Zhu Xuanming felt a bit impatient and had been in a bad mood for a long time in this place. Quote, Qian Renzu saw that Zhu Xuan's face had turned extremely pale, and she had a premonition that something big was about to happen. She felt a slight discomfort in her heart and her eyelids twitched. After learning about Zhu Xuan's strength, he remained silent and no one dared to act recklessly. He stood still with an extremely unpleasant expression, but he still tried to cover it up, fearing that if this demon god got angry, he would have to lie down all over the place. Zhu Xuan snapped his fingers and a spatial teleportation gate appeared in front of him. As he was about to leave the palace, Qian Jiazu spoke up first and said, Sir, can you tell me your name? Quote, Zhu Xuan felt bored when he saw the beauty not speaking and just wanted to leave, so he had the opportunity to strike up a conversation. Oh, am I familiar with you? Zhu Xuan spoke in a heavy tone, so he had to pretend to be good. I have seen your extraordinary strength, but it seems that the power you are using is not soul power. It is definitely not from the mainland, so only superpowers outside the mainland have it. I would like to learn from you. Zhu Xuan couldn't have imagined that this little angel would want to worship him as his teacher. He originally thought that at most, he was just trying to lure himself into the martial soul hall, and his ambition was even greater than he had imagined. No need. I have no intention of accepting my disciples yet, let alone that I just let your brother die in front of you. Don't you hate me? Zhu Xuan thought to himself, I love acting, right? It's great. Quote, stay with me until the end. Watching the conversation between the two on the side, I was also anxious in my heart. I couldn't be won over by the royal family. Otherwise how could the Seven Treasures Glass Sect live? Originally, the Seven Treasures and Glass Sect relied on the land of the Heavenly Tao to establish their roots. As the royal family did not have the title Duluo, they needed the protection of the Seven Treasures and Glass Sect in order to reach a deal. Now that this big shot helps the royal family, the Seven Treasures and Glass Sect will never have a bright future. This kind of thing must never happen. Ning Fengji immediately decided to do something. So he spoke up and said, Mr. Zhu. Before Ning Fengji could continue speaking, a reprimand came from him. Shut up. Is the emperor talking or are you talking? Zhu Xuan's eyes glanced at Ning Fengji and made her spine cool. This is too scary, isn't it? Now he is extremely uncomfortable in his heart. As the head of his own sect, he has a certain level of dignity when it comes to making a name for himself. As a result, Zhu Xuan doesn't give him any face, but he has no choice but to respect his strength. If others have strength, they must admire him. Otherwise, there will only be a dead end. That glance just now has already scared Ning Fengji and he dare not intervene. Qian Renzu secretly laughed in her heart, and her recent interruption clearly made the big shot in front of her very unhappy. The chances of winning the battle with the Martial Soul Hall were even greater. When Chan Renzu wants to speak again, flying outside at two speeds of light, it was the snake spear that pierced the blood of the two people. When the two of them saw the surrounding environment clearly, they were suddenly startled. The current palace is now in ruins, with broken stone slabs and countless soldiers lying dead. When his gaze shifted not far from Zhu Xuan, he saw a shocking scene that shocked the two of them. Dugu Bo, lying on the ground covered in blood, and there was a burnt black, skin-free corpse. Quote dot. There are some scattered metal objects around the body. What is this? Quote. The blood-piercing eye saw a badge that was unique to the royal family as proof of identity, but on a snowy night, Snowstar's body was still there. Isn't this? 
Is this the body of an avalanche? Now the bloodthirsty brain is blank. I don't know what exactly happened, but I feel a violent energy explosion in the palace, coupled with the collapse of the palace. Making the two of them realize that the young master is in danger and hurriedly rush here. Thorny Blood quickly looked at Kian Renzu and said, Fortunately, we are safe and sound. Only then did he feel a little relieved. Sting Blood. Why does the young master keep shaking his head at us? Did something happen? Shilong didn't understand for a moment and asked the nearby Sting Blood. Well, based on my judgment, the identity of the young master may have been exposed. The person in front of the young master may pose a threat to him, so he shook his head. Why doesn't he have any soul power fluctuations on him? Shi Long was very puzzled. Qian Renzu was very anxious as she saw the two worshippers whispering something quietly there. She didn't expect him to come over, and her plans were all disrupted. She only hoped that the two of them wouldn't do anything foolish. At this moment, without anyone being aware of it, Zhu Xuan opened a barrier. Inside, there were only Qian Renzu, Sting Blood, and Shi Long, while outside, everyone could only vaguely see the scene that Zhu Xuan hoped they would see. This was also for the sake of Qian Renzu's identity, after all, in the future. Within the barrier, Shi Long. Take him down. Thorned Blood suddenly shouted loudly. Immediately, the nine soul rings on the soles of the two feet were displayed, all of which were the best combination of soul rings. Yellow, yellow, purple, purple, black, 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 and black. Even Ning Fengji and Chen Xin were stunned and said, Isn't this the god of Ching'e? The soul sect is challenging this mysterious person. They went crazy. Chen Xin was about to rush out to help. He didn't want to play innocent people and lose his life but he forgot how powerful Mr. Zhu was. It was difficult for him to protect himself by going up. The Seven Treasures Glass sect would be in danger by then, so he restrained the urge to come forward. The Fifth Soul Skill, Thorn Bone Sting. The Sixth Soul Skill, Furious Spear Warfare. Spitting blood at his waist, she long aimed at his lower abdomen and shot. Two people simultaneously activate soul skills. Oh ho. Do you still look down on me? Don't you open the martial soul realm? Quote. Zhu Xuan had no other unnecessary movements. His fingers hooked and two smiling black balls appeared at his fingertips. Instantly shooting towards the opponent's soul skill, the speed was extremely fast. Even everyone present gasped for breath. Be merciful. Kian Renzu suddenly shouted. She just watched the fate of Dugu Bo, and even if she didn't die, she would be seriously injured. If she were to die, then the martial soul hall would not be an innocent sacrifice of two worshippers. You need to know the rarity of the title Duluo in this continent and how many resources are needed to accumulate into a title. At this moment, Kian Renzu didn't care about her identity exposure and blurted it out. Zhu Xuan's mouth curved slightly, and with a palm grip, the two small black balls exploded in the form of a small mushroom cloud before they reached the two of them. Spitting blood, Shi Long's face was full of disbelief. The damage was enough to cause serious injuries, let alone not close to the body and explode otherwise the consequences would be unimaginable. After a moment of hard work, she stabbed blood and flew out backwards, just like two disabled stray dogs. My name is Zhu Xuan, from Blue Star. I owe you a favor, but I need to repay it. By the way, don't worry about revealing your identity. I set up a barrier during the battle just now, and the two of them didn't die either. They just broke all their bones. Quote. 
This passage was transmitted by Zhu Xuan to Qian Renzu, and only she could hear it. Not even the gods could pry. In the blink of an eye, Zhu Xuan's figure disappeared without a trace, leaving no breath, as if this person had never been there before. How does he know my identity? Qian Renzu now belongs to a confused state, and even the title Duluo cannot see through his hiding. He is so surprised. After thinking for a while, Qian Renzu also let go. The opponent's strength may have reached the level of his grandfather. If you know, you should know. Since he knows, he didn't say it in front of others. There's no problem. Right. But, Zhu Xuan, I remember you. Qian Renzu clenched her fist and stared at where Zhu Xuan had disappeared. End of this chapter. Chapter 5. Continent Shakes. Major forces compete for Zhu Xuan. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 5. Continent Shakes. Major forces compete for Zhu Xuan. As soon as Zhu Xuan left, the barrier was automatically lifted. The scene that Ning Fengji just saw was just two guards from the Crown Prince. S mansion of the soul sect rushing to fight against Zhu Xuan, but it was a false scene. And no one noticed that Zhu Xuan had tampered with it. But Ning Fengji didn't see Zhu Xuan's figure in the blink of an eye, feeling a little disappointed. He had planned to use a trap relationship so that he wouldn't take action against the Seven Treasures and Glass sect in the future. After all, if he really did, the Seven Treasures and Glass sect might be a disaster of destruction. Immediately, Ning Fengji bid farewell to the hopeless and snowy knight lying on the throne, and then left the palace, which had become a ruin. Just saved a throne. This matter has come to an end, and the new imperial palace has been rebuilt under the care of the Shuiking River. The deceased guards have also been buried and the rest is being handled by the Shuiking River. Zhuai and Zhu Xing are both in a state of decline and daydreaming every day. Zhu Qing'e has a 100% confidence in controlling the Tiandu Empire. Originally, this plan would take several years, but precisely because Zhu Xuan's arrival could be advanced by several years. And during this period, as time passed, the mysterious powerhouse broke into the palace alone, killed the avalanche prince, and defeated the title Duluo, which was also widely rumored. The common people are applauding and cheering, and it has spread to the ears of major forces. Marshal Solhall, His Majesty the Pope, I have heard that various forces are investigating the mysterious person who killed the avalanche. It is said that he was also seriously injured and stabbed with blood. She spear can only rest in bed to this day, and his strength is definitely extraordinary. I don't know what we are, reported the effeminate chrysanthemum guan at this time. Yes, your majesty the Pope, being overtaken by other forces may be detrimental to the martial soul hall. Quote. The woman sitting on the throne of the Pope's Basilica is fair-skinned, with delicate features, dressed in a purple robe and revealing a long leg. She is closing her beautiful eyes as if pondering something, tapping her fingers on her scepter. The entire hall was silent, with only the sound of fingers touching the scepter. Bibadong slowly opened his beautiful eyes and gazed at the chrysanthemum pass. The two ghostly figures said, What's going on over there at the Temple of Worship? Quote, During this period, there has been no news at the moment, but the person has returned the message. Our people intercepted and saw the message in advance, which is related to this mysterious person. According to the belief, that mysterious person may have the power of extreme Duluo. When the ghost answered, they were a bit afraid and hesitant. After all, Bibadong had said in the Pope's palace before that no one should mention Chanrinzu. As they spoke, 
Zhu and Gui keenly sensed that His Majesty the Pope was not in the right mood, and their hands tightly grasped the scepter. Hm. If you find this person secretly, make sure to step down before other forces. Bibadong's emotions converge quickly, and most people cannot detect it. The reason why Ghost and Ju can feel it is because they have been following Bibadong for so long. I'm leaving. Ghost, after Ju Duluo stepped down. Bibadong murmured. Interesting. Extreme Duluo, within her knowledge, there are only three people in the entire continent. One is the old man from the Changia family who worships the temple, and the other is Tang Chen, the missing member of the Haoshan sect. The three sees God Island sacrifice and possess. She hopes it won't be Tang Chen. Otherwise the rise of the Haoshan sect will make the plan for the Martial Soul Hall to unify the continent even more difficult. Quote. Seven Treasure Glass Sect. Feng Ji. Is that Mr. Zhu really as mysterious as you said? I feel like you're making fun of me, Gu Rong said with a playful smile. Old Bone. Do you think Feng Ji is joking with you? Am I blind? Unless I am blind, this matter is a fact. Quote. Uncle Jian is right. And I have to believe that there are such extraordinary people in this world who have reached the strength equivalent to the ultimate Duluo at such a young age. It's truly a young hero. Uncle Jian and Uncle Gu, you can inform all disciples of the Seven Treasures and Glass Sect. When encountering this zoo, you must show goodwill and never offend him. It's best to make friends with the Seven Treasures and Glass Sect. Otherwise, alas, Ning Fengji won't continue talking. Dad, is that Mr. Zhu you just mentioned really so powerful? How powerful is extreme Duluo? Ning Rongrong eavesdropped outside the door and immediately ran in to inquire. Mr. Zhu. Ah. Quote. During this period of time, Zhu Xuan was in the Tianxing province and Tianxing city of the Star Luo Empire enjoying this wonderful life. In the hotel room, Zhu Xuan lay on a soft king bed and recalled that in his past life, he would screw screws every day, nine in the morning and five in the evening, without even having time to enjoy it. Traveling across this continent seems like a good choice, but what about my system? When I first entered this world, the system gave me all my strength and disappeared without a trace. Will I run away? This won't work. If my strength is just an experience card, it won't be enough. System. System. Quote. After calling twice, there was still no movement in his mind, which frightened Zhu Xuan. He wouldn't have been really hit by his own crow's mouth, right? So he quickly sat up and used various methods to call the system. Brother system. Sister system. Beautiful system. COI system. Grass. This is not the perfect rhythm. Why is this dog system so unreliable? The more he spoke, the more angry he became. What's wrong with this dog asterisk system? Is it Nissan? I'm Sir Asterisk. Really asterisk asterisk, Zhu Xuan scolded for a long time before stopping. He lay in bed with a sad expression, suspecting life. Ding. Detected that the host is about to crash, released first mission. Conquer the dark demon evil god tiger as a mount, reward. Unlock panel. When he finally heard the familiar sound of the machine, Zhu Xuan suddenly came to his senses. It turns out that the system panel has not been unlocked yet, but this system is really unreliable. I had to crash before posting a task to unlock it, right? Okay, okay, quote. However, before the task was released by the system, Zhu Xuan had the idea of catching a soul beast as a mount. After all, Standing on it was not as comfortable as sitting on a meat mat, and he could also pretend to be forced, which was a very good choice. 
Speaking of time, it was fast. Just as Zhu Xuan finished thinking, a spatial tunnel appeared in front of him with a snap of his finger. On the outskirts of the starry forest. Him. Zhu Xuan, who had just stepped out of space to teleport, felt a bit confused. The endless trees in front of me, such as the century-old beauty pine and the Chinese tree, how can this be different from the primitive forest of the past life? Quote, forget it, it's important, but this star forest is truly the largest forest. The question is, how can we find the dark demon evil god tiger system? How do you want me to find it? Quote, go system. Drop the chain at a critical moment, sigh. We still have to rely on ourselves. Quote, after speaking, Zhu Xuan began to mobilize the power of the demon god in his body and explore using his spiritual power. Don't be fooled. Zhu Xuan was startled to discover that he might have explored two-thirds of the starry forest area. This is equivalent to having a built-in radar system. Quote, however, the current level of strength given by the system is not yet clear. We can only wait to complete the task and check the panel. If divided by level, we can step on the void and activate space teleportation which should be at least the level of Divine King's strength. This is only Zhu Xuan's personal speculation. Please all book enthusiasts, make sure to follow up and read. New book data is really important. End of this chapter. Chapter 6. The Surrender of the Dark Demon Evil God Tiger. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 6. The Surrender of the Dark Demon Evil God Tiger. Under the teleportation of Zhu Xuan, S space, coupled with the radar-like spirit detection. The trace of the Dark Demon and Evil God Tiger was soon discovered. Southern Peripheral Area. At this moment, the Dark Demon Demon Tiger was resting in a large cave and did not sense anything amiss nearby. But the third premonition of the soul beast told him that something was about to happen, so he got up and looked around for a moment. A typical dark demon demon tiger has been around for over 10,000 years, and its intelligence is equivalent to that of a human being in their teens. Now, based on the size, tail, and head color of this demon tiger, it has a lifespan of approximately 50,000 years. Just as the dark demon demon tiger wanted to lie down and continue to sleep. The space at the entrance of the cave began to distort, deform, and shatter. A man emerged from the black hole, and it was Zhu Xuan. The dark demon evil god tiger was staring at Zhu Xuan tightly with his tiger eyes. Why did this human appear here out of thin air? Why did he not have any soul power breath on him? But could he destroy space and teleport here? The current dark demon evil god tiger has many problems, causing his tiger head to have a short circuit for a moment. Are you the dark demon evil god tiger? Zhu Xuan looked at the big tiger across from him, appearing calm on the surface, but in fact, his heart was already filled with joy. After all, which blue star person doesn't like handsome and powerful brain tigers? Moreover, this brain tiger is even more handsome, larger, and exudes an evil aura all over its body. Zhu Xuan looked at the dark demon evil god tiger while praising it repeatedly, feeling very satisfied. This has infuriated the dark demon evil god tiger. This human dared to look at himself in front of him and even showed a greedy look. I'm looking for death. Quote. The dark demon evil god tiger had just raised its paw and wanted to slap Zhu Xuan into a patty, but was shocked to find that its body couldn't move anymore. What's going on? At this moment, the dark demon demon tiger felt a sense of unease in his heart. I give you a chance to live. Submit to me, and be my mount. Quote. The dark demon evil god tiger did not answer, 
but stared at Zhu Xuan with fierce eyes, as if telling him that he was going to eat him. I know you can speak people's words. Being my mount obediently is your ultimate destiny. Human. Although I cannot feel the fluctuation of your soul power inside, my dark demon evil god Tiger Clan cannot yield to humans. What a commotion. Zhu Xuan's palm pressed down fiercely, a wave of authority descending. Let the already immobile dark demon demon tiger kneel on the ground, unable to move. The palm slightly retracted, and its huge tiger body was also forcibly squeezed. I will give you one last chance. Don't think I am good at speaking. My patience is limited. Quote. And as the emperor's mount, why not let me make you a god? Since you are so ignorant, let's die. Quote. Just as Zhu Xuan was about to grip his palm tightly, the dark demon demon tiger squeezed out two words from the tiger's mouth. Wait. Quote. Upon hearing this, Zhu Xuanzong opened his palm and the pressure was automatically lifted. You just said you could make me a god. But you're deceiving me. Ever since the soul beast clan was driven out of the divine realm by human gods, even with millions of years of cultivation, soul beasts cannot become gods. How difficult is it? As long as you follow me, let alone become a god, how difficult is it for me to overthrow this divine realm alone? Zhu Xuan also understood that in this direction, he was already an invincible existence, accompanied by a system, and the divine realm himself looked down upon. The dark devil, the evil spirit and the tiger also know that they will become the soul ring of others one day, or die from robbery. Only a god can live long and gain endless life. Instead of hiding every day, it is better to trust this human once. After all, his strength is completely invisible to himself. Seeing the dark demon evil god Tiger hesitating and not even calling out to its owner, he suddenly felt a little dissatisfied and said, What a grind. Quote, a moment of thought, countless dark auras surrounded the dark demon and evil god Tiger. The brain tiger shrouded in it was very confused, thinking that he was going to repent, and suddenly became anxious. Click. 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 The bones of the dark demon evil god made a clicking sound, causing the bones of his whole body to shatter and causing him to scream repeatedly. Master. I know I was wrong. Please forgive me. At this moment, the dark demon demon tiger was filled with fear, thinking that the other party had turned back, just as it thought it was about to die. Discovering that these breaths are repairing their shattered bones, some power is pouring into the head. This is the power of the demon god bestowed upon you by our emperor. After absorbing it, you can be promoted to 100,000 years and avoid future thunder tribulations. Upon hearing Zhu Xuan's words, the dark demon evil god was very surprised. The welfare of 100,000 years. You don't have to suffer from thunder tribulations in the future. Really impressed him. It has to be said that Zhu Xuan's method of giving a big stick first and then sweet dates is very applicable. Ding. Congratulations to the host for subduing the dark demon evil god tiger. Reward. Unlock system panel. Open black lens bracket reward. Soul lock circle. One close black lens bracket. Finally completed the task. System. What is this soul searching circle? Zhu Xuan was puzzled and even gave a small gadget to the unlock panel. The soul lock ring can be used to wear mounts and pets around the neck. It can be activated with the host's blood. Once the soul lock ring is worn, it will activate 100% loyalty without changing personality and thoughts. Not bad. Not bad. The system finally has a conscience, right? Quote. Zhu Xuan thought that the system was not awesome at all but there was an extra reward for completing the task. 
Coincidentally, this cerebellar tiger can try the effect. Quote. After speaking, Zhu Xuan squeezed out a drop of blood from his finger and it dripped onto the soul-locking circle. Suddenly, the soul-locking circle emitted a dazzling light, automatically searching for nearby targets, and directly placed it on the neck of the dark demon demon tiger, which was absorbing energy. Him. Master. What is this thing? Said the little black tiger for a moment. This is called the soul lock circle. If you don't listen, he will strangle you. But he can also save your life in critical moments. Quote. Upon hearing Zhu Xuan's words, the dark demon evil god felt as if he had turned into a dog. Well, anyway, the master's strength is unparalleled. What about being his dog? It's not even stronger than those so-called forest lords. When it comes to the hegemon, the dark demon and evil god tiger, they think of the titan ape, the sky blue bull python, who did not allow himself to live in the central area of the star forest before. Now that I have the support of a big shot, I cannot seek revenge. Master, there are still 200,000 year old soul beast level masters in the star Dao forest. Should we? Quote. Zhu Xuan saw this small brain tiger and immediately understood its thoughts. Let these two soul beasts be free and unrestrained for a while longer. I have more important things to do. Quote. The dark demon evil god tiger can only obediently shut up and concentrate on absorbing the remaining energy. Several hours have passed. When the light source around the dark demon demon tiger disappears, the aura emitted is extremely terrifying. The dark demon evil god tiger clan can level up and fight 100,000 in 50,000 years. The current one is enough to dominate the star Dao forest, but it's hard to say what's under the lake of life. Master, I am truly. I have reached 100,000 yuan. Thank you very much for your kindness. I will definitely go through fire and water, and I will not hesitate. Quote. Well, there's no need to say so much nonsense. I'm going to the Tianshui city of the heavenly Dao Empire now. It's probably not appropriate for you to be like this. Quote. Zhu Xuangang, who had just crossed over, was saved by her in a simple small house in Tianshui city. She was in a hurry to seek revenge at that time and did not yet know her name. Well, my master, I have just arrived at 100,000 years old, and it may take some time for me to transform. The dark demon evil god, Tiger, felt ashamed. I can help you without any hindrance. Quote. Book friends group in the bottom left corner of the introduction tilde. End of this chapter. Chapter 7. Searching for the Savior. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 7. Searching for the Savior. Zhu Xuan waved his palm and a beam of light penetrated into the body of the dark demon evil god tiger. Suddenly, the dark demon demon tiger felt its body rapidly shrinking until it became the size of a palm. Master, I said the dark demon and evil god tiger, would it be too late to transform myself into what I looked like in my childhood? Quote. Immediately, Zhu Xuan's gaze frightened the dark demon and evil god tiger from speaking. Let's go. Quote. Zhu Xuan held the dark demon and evil god tiger in his hand, and the space in front of him twisted and shattered. A figure walked into the space portal. Tiandu Empire, Tianshui City. Ah, brother, have you heard about it? There was a mysterious person who was said to be able to fight thousands of soldiers and horses with just one person. Quote, Fart, how could there be such a powerful person? Soul masters don't have that much soul power, do they? Quote, No. I heard my distant cousin say that this person broke into the palace alone and killed the avalanche prince on the spot, suppressing poison Duluo. 
If I had to be so powerful, I would have slept with all the beauties. He he. Shaoliot Si. Why do you think about these things every day? That mysterious person is a real immortal living in the world. If we kill this dog prince, we ordinary people don't have to worry anymore. Right. Right. Quote. In front of Li Ji Noodle Restaurant in Tianshui City, everyone was discussing Zhu Xuan's matter one by one. Sister. Do you think that mysterious person is so powerful? If he really is, he must not be handsome. He is an uncle. You a. Uh. Killing that dandy from Avalanche has indeed helped many people avoid bullying. But there may be some trouble now. After all, he killed the crown prince of the heavenly Tao Empire. And it won. T be so easy to give up easily. Every day I know if I want to have a handsome guy. Are you still so young and looking for a man? Sister. Who said I want a man? But it's not impossible if I'm very handsome. By the way, the teacher asked us to go to the soul fighting arena to compete. Hurry up. Maybe we'll already be waiting for the two of us there, said Shui Binger, the younger sister of Yan Kong. Shui Bing was thinking all the way about how the person she saved earlier was doing. After all, I went to the college before and came back after a while, so I didn't see him. I'm worried if something unexpected happened. As soon as the two of them left, Zhu Xuan arrived here. This time, Zhu Xuan wore a mask on his face to avoid unnecessary trouble. After all, he was so handsome, and it wouldn't be good if he had bewitched all the girls in Tianshui City. Over Tianshui City, Zhu Xuan watched the people coming and going on the street, rubbed his forehead, and said, How can we find this? Quote, the dark demon demon tiger in his hand tilted its head and said, Master, what are you looking for? Maybe I can help. You soul beast. How could you possibly understand humans? I am looking for someone who is important to me. But I don't know her name, only her appearance. Quote. Zhu Xuan recalled the memory before. The other party had a stunning beauty, wearing a blue skirt blue hair carrying fragrance, and fair long legs that were very attractive. Previously, Zhu Xuan had guessed that it was the cold imperial sister from the original work, Shui Binger, but it didn't seem to fit his personality, so he didn't think so. But upon closer examination, it does seem a bit similar. Master, the people below have noticed us, it's too embarrassing. The dark demon demon tiger quickly turned its butt towards the outside, its head towards the palm of its hand, making a gesture of wanting to defecate. Startled by Zhu Xuan's palm, the tiger face of the dark demon demon tiger quickly descended towards the ground. Master! The dark demon evil god tiger didn't expect it. He felt too embarrassed and didn't want to see it. As a result, he was mistaken by his master for wanting to defecate, so he threw himself down. As the dark demon demon tiger was about to land, Zhu Xuan's palms sucked and it flew back to its original position. Next time, remember to say, how did I know that after living for so long, you still knew you wanted a tiger face? Single quote quote. The dark demon demon tiger awkwardly scratched its head with its claws. Immediately, Zhu Xuan walked into the space teleportation again. He knew that it was not appropriate to make such a big fuss on the street and that it might even cause some ant riots. Did you see it? Did someone in the sky just now? I remember something black fell down. It should be a bird. I'm not mistaken. The one above is a figure, still wearing a white robe. Can it be that mysterious person? I just saw a mask on his face, it must be that mysterious person coming to Tianshui City haha. -ha. Quote. The farmers on the street were chatting about what had just happened one by one, 
and Zhu Xuanshu didn't know that this appearance would attract countless strong people from the mainland to win over. It seems like this is where it is. Zhu Xuan felt a familiar atmosphere in the northern central area of Tian Shuicheng Street. This aura was very similar to what she had before, and the scene before her was a small and medium-sized mansion. What is this? Quote, on the plaque of the mansion, several large characters were prominently written. Shuijia Mansion. Quote, All Day Water City, only this mansion has the largest size, but Zhu Xuan doesn't think so, at most it can be considered a small house. But how could there be her aura here? Quote, Zhu Xuan began to think. He clearly remembered that when he was rescued, the house was nothing more than a rundown cottage in a leaky alley. Zhu Xuan didn't care so much. He immediately walked out of the space and stepped step by step into the void. When he arrived at the entrance of the water mansion, he knocked on the door. Before that, Zhu Xuan had already taken off his mask and changed his clothes into a long green robe. The dark demon evil god Tiger was also very clever and did not come out. Now Zhu Xuan's appearance resembles that of a weak scholar. Dong dong dong. Dong dong dong. Who is it? Quote. The door was pushed open from the inside out, and there stood an elderly man in his fifties standing at the entrance. His skin was wrinkled, but his face was radiant and his flesh was very plump. He should be the butler of this mansion. May I ask if this is Master Shui? I have something to talk to her about. There is a reason why Zhu Xuan didn't mention the emperor at this time. He actually wants to see if this place is also a place where the dog's eyes look down on people. The elderly butler looked at Zhu Xuan's appearance which was also considered a wealthy family's child, and respectfully said, this distinguished guest, please wait a moment. I will go and report to the head of the household now. Quote, after a moment, the head of the Shui family, Shui Tiancheng, arrived at the door and looked at the young man in front of him, feeling a bit confused, as if he didn't even know him, but still tentatively asked, May I ask who you are? I'm not here to find you. Is Shui Bing Air at home? Quote, now Zhu Xuan has a great deal of confidence that Shui Bing Air is the girl who saved him back then. After all, the atmosphere here is extremely familiar and strong. Shui Shencheng looked at Zhu Xuan with a hint of suspicion, thinking that since it wasn't for him, it should also be her classmate or friend who was looking for Bing Air. Surprisingly, he didn't know that she had gone to the Soul Fighting Arena to participate in the competition. This person's origin is unknown, so he must first try and explore. After speaking, Shui Shen Cheng didn't say a word and directly activated his martial soul. A brilliant icicle passed by, and six soul rings rose from his feet, white, yellow, yellow, purple, purple, black. Zhu Xuan saw the other party distancing himself and summoning a martial soul, seeming to suspect himself. However, the soul ring configuration of the father, in, law seems too poor, he said. Zhu Xuan didn't. T want to reveal his identity. So he used the power of the demon god to simulate some soul rings and martial souls. End of this chapter. Chapter 8. The configuration of the father-in-law's soul ring is not very good. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 8. The configuration of the father-in-law's soul ring is not very good. When Shui Cheng across from him looked at Zhu Xuan with pride, little did he know that Zhu Xuan would startle everyone later. After the conversion was completed, Zhu Xuan summoned his martial soul without saying a word. The sky was shrouded in dark clouds, and just as it was clear for thousands of miles, now it was lightning and thunder, giving Shui Tiancheng a bad feeling. 
two black and purple magic dragons slowly poked out their dragon heads from behind Zhu Xuan. The pitch black and hollow dragon eyes emitted an aura that frightened Xuishan Cheng. What kind of martial soul is this? Xuishan Cheng was puzzled and immediately asked the butler next to him. But the butler has never seen such dragon-like martial souls before. This continent is known to the world except for the blue electric Tyrannosaurus rex family, which inherited the blue electric Tyrannosaurus rex. There are indeed many geniuses of dragon-like martial souls, big and small, but the two of them who have lived for so long have never seen such a powerful dragon-like martial soul, including the blue electric Tyrannosaurus rex. It seems that they are not so terrifying. Subsequently, several bright red soul rings slowly rose from the soles of Zhu Xuan's feet. Red, 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 red. Feng. Title. Du Luo. Xuishan was so scared that he collapsed to the ground, his legs constantly shivering. The butler on one side was even more frightened causing a foul-smelling liquid to flow out of his crotch. The two of them are still in a state of extreme shock and confusion just now, completely unaware that there will be a title Duluo in Shuicheng on this day. What is even more shocking is Zhu Xuan's 900,000-year soul rings. Fortunately, at that time, Zhu Xuan had restrained his pressure and most of his breath. Otherwise, it was probably not two people lying in front of him, but a pool of blood. After a moment, the two of them regained their senses and immediately got up from the ground, saying, Your Highness, oh no, this crown prince. I have just offended you so much. Please don't blame me. Quote, Master, just now this old man in the human world spoke in such an aggressive tone. If he didn't agree, he would take action. We must teach him a good lesson, said the dark demon evil god Tiger angrily. If you don't speak, no one will consider you mute, Zhu Xuan whispered to the little annoyed tiger in the space. No problem. Get up. I'm not an unreasonable person. Your daughter and Shui Bing are good friends, so you don't have to be like that either. So the underworld is Bing Er's friend, isn't it? Quote. Upon hearing these words, Shui Tiancheng was stunned and thought to himself, how could Bing Er know such a strong person? Even the martial soul hall may not have the same level of expertise as this adult. When Bing Er comes back later, he must ask clearly about his background. Where is she? Zhu Xuan asked his own doubts directly and he didn't want to communicate too much with this uncle. Her father's soul ring ratio is not very good either. Quote, Bing Air had just left home for only half a quarter of an hour, and you came. Shuishan turned into a pleasing face and pulled up a large fake smile beside him. Where are we going? My daughter is going to participate in the team soul fighting at the great soul fighting field and it may take a long time before she can come back. Why not? Shuishan Kost wanted to keep Zhu Xuan here for a cup of tea, but the trick was close, but Zhu Xuan and didn't tea give him any face. No need. Quote. Turning his head, he walked into the black hole behind him and disappeared. Master, how did the young lady get to know this adult? The butler actually didn't say a word just now and couldn't even get in touch, otherwise he would have wanted to go up and say a few words. Since ancient times, no one has had a reverence for the strong and wants to win him over. How do I know? Quote. Shuishan looked at the old butler speechlessly, then walked into the study without looking back. The seat in the last corner of the ice and snow soul battle arena. Master, what are you waiting for? The dark demon evil god Tiger didn't understand Zhu Xuan very much. They had been waiting here for several matches, 
but there was no sign of Zhu Xuan leaving. By the way, it seems that the emperor has never given you a name. Why don't we just call you, C.O. Hei? Anyway, you are also so black. I don't protest. This name sounds too unpleasant. It's not as good as my original name. Quote. The dark demon evil god Tiger thought its owner would hold back some good reputation, but in the end. Isn't this just a nickname for a dog? I am a fierce beast at the level of a powerful hegemon. Quote. What's wrong? You seem very dissatisfied with the name given to you by our emperor. Zhu Xuanxuan turned his head and stared coldly at the dark demon demon tiger on his shoulder. No. No. How could it not sound good? I like the names chosen by the master. The dark demon evil god tiger was also very helpless. Who knew Zhu Xuan was so powerful? So powerful that even a glance from this hegemon level ferocious beast made him afraid. Zhu Xuan no longer cared about this obedient little brain tiger and continued to pay attention to the upcoming Tianshui Academy team. The host in the middle of the flying soul guide said, Hello everyone. I am the host of this competition, Wang Dabba. Now let's invite the most eye-catching team from Tianshui Academy to appear. Quote. This sentence from the Tianshui Academy team seems to ignite the passion of everyone in the audience, with shouts echoing one after another. Goddess. You finally made your debut. I've been waiting for you for a long time to buy a ticket. Goddesses explode on the opposite side. Tianshui Academy will win. It will always be my god. Quote. The vast majority of the audience present were heading towards the match at Tianshui Academy, naturally attracting much attention. The iron gate on the right side of the competition venue slowly opened upwards, revealing a row of long legs that captivated everyone. There are even some individuals whose nostrils have been lifted out due to bleeding. Obviously, this level of nature cannot cause significant emotional fluctuations for Zhu Xuan. Interestingly, the Tianshui team in this world doesn't need to compete. Would it be better to form a women's team and debut directly? Quote. When Zhu Xuan's gaze saw the face of the leader in the middle, he suddenly froze. It's really her. Quote. Obviously. It was already certain that the woman who saved her before was Shui Binger, but seeing it with her own eyes couldn't help but conceal the excitement in her heart. All of this was seen by the dark demon and evil god Tiger. Originally, the master was waiting for her. However, this human woman looks a bit unattractive. Quote, in its eyes, the larger the body size, the fuller it is best. The Tianshui team performed a fiery dance, which drew cheers from the crowd. But Shui Binger noticed a person in the corner of the last row in the distance. She was puzzled why the other party chose to sit so far. But I inexplicably feel a bit familiar. Wang Dabba spoke up and said, Let's invite the opponents of Tianshui Academy, Shenfeng Academy to enter. Woohoo! Shenfeng Academy is the best. Quote. Feng. You're the most handsome person on the opposite side. And almost all the cheers from the Kamikaze Academy were girls cheering and cheering. Obviously, it is not as popular as the Tianshui girl group. Shenfeng Academy. Quote. Zhu Xuan carefully recalled this college and quickly realized that the four major element colleges would compete almost every year to decide which college would be the leader. Wang Dabba quickly controlled the soul guide to fly into the air, picked up the microphone, and said, Both sides prepare on stage. The two teams stepped onto the competition stage together. Everyone must continue to read. Thank you. End of this chapter. Chapter 9. Go to the Ice and Snow Soul Fighting Arena, it's really her. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 9.
Go to the Ice and Snow Soul Fighting Arena, it's really her. The team's soul battle has officially begun. Quote. When the host Wang Dabba finished speaking, he immediately adjusted the height of the soul guide, fearing that even a little slower would result in farting. Both sides did not speak much and collectively activated the martial soul. And Zhu Xuan in the corner was watching the game with great interest. Two sensitive attack soul masters from the Shenfeng Academy activated their soul skills and surrounded them from both sides. Feng Shaoshan is the main attacking force. Everyone set up their formation and act according to the plan, Shui Binger ordered, and all teammates nodded in agreement. Cheng surrounded and approached Shui Binger, while she stood in the center. First soul skill. Ice ceiling. Directly swing towards the two quick attacking soul masters approaching rapidly. Instantly slowing down their speed. However, Feng Shaoshan still hasn't stopped or changed tactics, and the unique skills he brought this time have not been used, let alone his great confidence in his self-created soul skills. Two transparent hand knives appeared in the palms, and two sword energies swung towards the souls of their teammates. In just a moment, Shui Binga's soul technique was cracked. Following closely behind, their auxiliary teammates immediately gave them amplitude-type soul skills. Watching her teammates start to panic, Shui Binga can only come up with this strategy. Snow dance. She heard Shui Binga call her and quickly turned her head to look. The two of them looked at each other, and Zhu Wu understood in a second. She immediately rushed towards Shui Binga. All of this was seen by Feng Shaoshan, who knew that even if he tried hard, he couldn't stop it. So I started to gather my strength and use my big moves. Second soul skill. Dual wolf possession. Quote. The third soul skill. Double wings of the wind. Quote. 36 consecutive slashes of the wind demon wolf. Suddenly, two pale green wings appeared driving the whole body into the air. The sharp claws in their hands suddenly appeared, and the sharp light pierced their eyes, making it impossible for most ordinary spectators present to see. Feng Shaoshan's self-created soul skill is said to use speed and gravity to continuously enhance his attack power with each attack. Ding ding ding. Feng Shaoshan wanted to ride against Shui Binga, S martial soul fusion skill before it could be activated, so she used her teammates to strike for the 35th time, and with the final blow, she directly broke through the martial soul fusion skill. In this way, I can be said to have put on a big show. Zhu Xuan caught a glimpse of Feng Shaoshan's careful thinking. If she gets injured, there's no need for your so called kamikaze academy to exist. This sentence can be heard clearly by the dark demon and evil god Tiger on his shoulder. Sweating stood up. After all, the tone of this sentence was still heavy, and others would naturally not believe the authenticity of this statement. But it has personally tried the terrifying aspects of Zhu Xuan. Not to mention being just a college, no one can stop it on the entire continent. When Snow Dance arrives at Shui Bing Air, the two of them shouted at the same time, martial soul fusion technique, drifting on ice and snow. Quote, Suddenly, a huge ice and snow tornado rolled up on the field, and a loud phoenix cry echoed throughout the entire soul fighting arena. The temperature inside the soul fighting arena is extremely decreasing, causing everyone present to feel cold and the sound of Ah Chu is heard repeatedly. But the influence of the other party's Feng Shaoshan is not very significant, because his current stacking level has reached a terrifying $34. These last two knives can be described as knives, they are deadly. Qi Shuang's expression showed no fear at all, only a solemn expression. She dared not unleash the maximum effect of her soul skill 
as it would accidentally harm everyone present. Ah, you're still too kind, Zhu Xuan said helplessly. Zhu Xuan laughed mischievously, and a ball of energy the size of a fingernail suddenly appeared in his fingers, rapidly moving towards Shui Binger in the field. Even the senior management of the two colleges did not notice this energy. At the moment she flew into Shuing's body, she suddenly felt something unusual. The soul power in one's own body is uncontrollable, quickly converging on fusion techniques, but with a continuous supply of energy. What's going on? At this moment, Shui Bing Air was completely paralyzed. What's wrong? Bing Air. Zhu Wu noticed the change in Shui Bing, er, s expression and asked with concern, as time goes by, the strength gathers stronger and there is a faint feeling of explosion, not the physical explosion. But the energy in soul skills has been maximized. At this moment, Feng Xiaoshan also felt the danger, but he didn't believe it. Shortly thereafter, Feng Xiaoshan will soon be defeated by his arrogance. The last cut. Feng Xiaoshan stabbed directly at Shui Bing Air from the air. Ice, be careful, shouted the teammate on the side. Their captain cannot be injured, after all, it hasn't been long since the Soul Master competition. The Tianshui supervisor standing on the second floor also showed a worried expression. But as the mentor of Shenfeng Academy, he looks proud and confident. His self-created soul skills are invincible among his peers, and he really can't think of how to lose to Tianshui. But unfortunately, before Zhu Xuan came, it was true that Shenfeng had a stable winning situation, but now it is definitely not. When the two soul skills are about to collide, Shui Binger loudly reminded, be careful. If I lose control of my power this time, I will accidentally harm you. Quote. But when these words reached Feng Xiaoshan's ears, they became a provocation and humiliation. This made the captain of his impressive Shenfeng Academy lose face and suddenly feel a bit angry. He will not interrupt this final strike but rather let the people of Tianshui Academy see how he seriously injured Shui Binger. When the two soul skills collide, a huge energy impact is generated, and all of their teammates on the field are shaken off the field. Smoke shrouded, and the supervisor of Tianshui Academy on the second floor was very worried about the battle situation below. She didn't expect the opponent's strength to be so strong either. If, Bing Air gets injured and returns to the college, it won't be easy to fulfill her duties. Quote, I wanted to jump down immediately to check the situation, but was stopped by the staff of the Soul Fighting Arena and said, no unrelated personnel are allowed to enter the competition venue. Quote, host Wang Dabba also became unconscious due to the aftershocks generated by the energy and was unable to explain the current situation. Everyone seems to be stuck in this moment in their hearts, quietly waiting for the final result, to arrive at that college. Zhu Xuan, who was in the corner, was not worried at all. He curved his lips and muttered to himself, You brought this on your own, no wonder I'm the emperor. Quote, The dark demon and evil god Tiger, who witnessed Zhu Xuan's methods, just lay quietly on his shoulder and ate melons. Unexpectedly, the master is also a species of infatuation. Quote, After a long time, the smoke on the field slowly dissipated, and Shui Binger still stood in the center of the field without moving at all. On the other hand, Feng Xiaoshan's clothes were tattered and he lay in a disheveled state across from him with countless wounds on his body, big and small, and a patch of blood still remaining at the corner of his mouth. Now there is a complete silence. No one could have imagined that Tianshui College would win. In the past, Tianshui College had become a god wind, and the people who came to cheer were mostly to see beautiful women. 
Even more, he stared blankly at the mentor on the kamikaze side, his small expression as if he had just finished eating a dead fly. The teachers at Tianshui College breathed a sigh of relief, feeling both relieved and surprised. They couldn't believe that Binger had won the game without any injuries. Unbelievable. As one person in the audience applauded, it was as if they had found a vent, and countless people thundered with applause. End of this chapter. Chapter 10. Overturning the soul fighting field. Who dares to touch her? You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 10 Overturning the Soul Fighting Field. Who dares to touch her? But the host Wang Daba is unconscious and unable to continue the commentary. So his brothers climbed onto the competition stage. Hello everyone. My name is Wang Dadiao. I'm sorry, but there was a slight issue. Now I will announce the results of the competition. Quote. In this team match between Shenfeng Academy and Tianshui Academy, due to Miss Shui Binger's suspicion of fraud, the Soul Fighting Field has decided to detain her for further investigation. Quote, Judging as the victory of Shenfeng Academy, the audience expressed dissatisfaction upon hearing this result. Isn't this lying with my eyes open? It's too unfair to my goddesses. That's it. That's it. This soul fighting arena is too bullying, isn't it? They say others are cheating without providing evidence, and they still want to keep people here. They think they are something. Quote, dare to touch my goddess, I'll fight you hard. But Shui Binger didn't rush to refute, so she stood still in place. She couldn't figure out why it was like this, why her strength was not under her control. What exactly is the problem? On the third floor of the backstage of the soul fighting arena, a middle, aged scarred man dressed in luxurious black clothes was holding a tall glass. Crossing his legs and enjoying red wine with a look on his face. Remember to bring the captain of Tianshui Academy over later. He's truly a gem in the world. He he tilde tilde tilde. Boss. I have already sent someone to handle this matter. I will send the beauty over later. That's it. Second, please wipe your saliva. When I finish enjoying this little beauty first, it's yours. Thank you, boss. The conversation here was also heard clearly by Zhu Xuan outside. At this moment, there was only a strong killing intent in his eyes, and the nearby aura also became eerie. The supervisor of Tianshui College immediately descended from the second floor and landed next to Shui Binga. What's wrong with Bing Air? He asked as he spoke. Teacher, why can't I control the soul power inside my body? Why is this happening? She never expected Feng Shaoshan to be beaten up like this. The young woman's mentor spoke up and comforted. Bing Air, I'm here. Don't be afraid. Even if the teacher tries his best, he won't let you stay in this soul-fighting arena. Quote. Moreover, the college is not far from here. So they should also consider the college's face and dare not take action. Quote. In fact, young women's mentors nowadays are also very anxious. After all, other students are unconscious. If they blindly protect Shui Bing Air, what should Zhu Wu and Yu Er do? She is very conflicted, after all, they are all her own students. The mentor from Shenfeng Academy is also walking towards this side. Including the unique guards of the soul fighting field, two rows of guards walked in unison, surrounding Shui Binger and the young women's mentor in groups. Please, Miss Shui Binger, come with us. Our main supervisor will review you in person, said the captain of the guard. The teacher from Qi Shenfeng Academy changed his mind and said, I want to take Shui Bing Air away for investigation. Her ability to catch Xiao Tian's self-created soul technique unscathed is very suspicious. 
The current situation has formed a fierce battle between the divine wind and the ice and snow soul field. Master, are we going up? The nearby human strength is very weak, and I can kill them with just one claw. Returning to the space, I would like to see who can take her away today. Quote, it's the master. Immediately, the dark demon and evil god Tiger quickly entered the space to cover up their breath. It knows that Zhu Xuan is in a bad mood now. It's impossible for oneself to be uninterested. After all, in the future we'll have to rely on Zhu Xuan, this big shot, to take care of us. Great. Is this the face of the ice and snow battle soul field and the divine wind academy? Everyone looked around and only saw a masked man in a green robe sitting in the corner. Zhu Xuan stood up, his body suspended in the air. With each step taken in the void, there will be space fragmentation on the soles of the feet, and soul rings will slowly rise from the soles of the feet. Red, 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 red. Nine blood red soul rings appeared in the eyes of everyone in the soul fighting arena. The previous noise has completely disappeared, and the beating of the heart can be heard clearly. Fear fills everyone present. Just in a blink of an eye, Zhu Xuan came to the side of Shui Binger. Pick up Shui Binger with both hands and squat down, ready to cry. Zhu Xuan spoke gently and said, don't be afraid. No one here dares to touch you. Quote. This sentence directly hit Shui Binga's heart and gave her a sense of security. She looked at the man who lifted her up with a clear gaze and asked, Why is your voice so familiar to me? Do we know each other? At this moment, Shui Binga had not yet recognized the masked man in front of her, who was the young man she had rescued casually. The mentor of the Shenfeng Academy stood up and said, Your Highness, this woman, we. He hasn't finished speaking yet. He instantly exploded and died, spraying blood on nearby guards. Zhu Xuan said to Shui Binger in his arms, Don't open your eyes, I'll take you home. Quote, Zhu Xuan didn't want her to see this bloody scene. But these people, including those two who coveted her, had to die. Amidst the frightened gazes of the crowd, a spatial passage slowly appeared in front of Zhu Xuan. Helplessly speaking out, you can follow me from Tian Shui College. Quote, the meaning of this sentence is already very clear. If it weren't for Shui Bing Air, he wouldn't care about anyone here. As soon as Zhu Xuan finished speaking, the young woman dragged the students of Tian Shui College into the space passage one by one. Her only chance now is to take a gamble. Zhu Xuan is not a bad person, otherwise she will become a true sinner. Can I take off your mask? Shui Binger said shyly. She has never had any physical contact with a boy, let alone being hugged by Zhu Xuan as a princess. There was a hazy expression in his eyes, his cheeks flushed like ripe red apples, and even a slight blush behind his ears. Of course, Zhu Xuan said in an extremely gentle tone, See oh hey, wash the guards, hosts, and others of the entire soul fighting arena with blood. The audience can spare it, and those two soul emperors will bring it to me. It's the master. The dark demon and evil god Tiger became excited as soon as they heard the sound. Finally, I have made contributions ha ha. Immediately fly towards the soul fighting field outside the space. When Zhu Xuan's mask was gently lifted by Shui Binger, the enchanting cheeks of all beings were revealed. You. You were the one I saved at the time. Shui Binger couldn't believe it. After all, Zhu Xuan was on the brink of death at that time, and she couldn't have imagined that Zhu Xuan's strength would be so extraordinary. After all, he was so young and titled Duluo. She has never heard of anything in this continent, 
and there is also Zhu Xuan's beauty. Let her, who is not Yan Kong, be somewhat moved. Pop it, pop it, pop it. Now the distance between the two is just enough to hear each other's heartbeat. I finally know your name now. Can I call you Bing Er? End of this chapter.